my name is Ellen Koyman. I'm originally from the Netherlands, but I'm currently living in Sweden. I am a geoscientist working at the Swedish Museum of Natural History. As someone who has used Lego bricks for many years as a way to express my creativity, I couldn't help but notice that there were very few female minifigures in regular Lego sets. When the Lego group launched a platform where fan designers can submit their ideas for Lego sets, I saw an opportunity to change that by designing a set of female characters in interesting professions. I decided to design a set of three different female scientists. I designed the Lego Research Institute set fully digitally using freely available software. When my initial design was finished, I posted it online to gather support. During this stage, I received a lot of feedback from LEGO fans and made some changes as a result. I then had to gather 10,000 supporters, so social media were very important. The original design had a larger number of characters, including a falconer, a geologist, and an engineer. But LEGO asked me to reduce the number to three, so I selected the astronomer, the paleontologist, and the chemist. After a fan design is accepted for production, there is an internal process at LEGO where it is evaluated and tested to make sure it fulfills their quality standards. The LEGO Research Institute was brought into the collection as part of rapid response collecting. This is where we bring objects of design into the museum when they're the subject of popular and critical conversation. One of her key motivations for putting this idea forward was to encourage young girls into STEM careers, so science, technology, engineering and mathematics. Representation, who we see around us and what values we ascribe to different jobs and life outlooks needs discussion. The LEGO Research Institute set was so popular, it sold out within a week. Since this set has been produced, more and more female minifigures have been added to regular sets, making the LEGO universe a much more balanced society. My advice to any young people interested in design is always to be open-minded and try to think outside the box. Don't be afraid to express your creativity.